32 Turkish Van Cat Facts Every Owner Should Know Number 1. Turkish Vans are considered a large cat breed, with males typically reaching weights of 10 to 20 pounds and females ranging from 7 to 12 pounds. This makes them significantly larger than average domestic cats that stand at 8 to 10 pounds. Number 2. The name Van comes from the Van province in Turkey, where the cat is believed to have originated. Lake Van and the city of Van are both located in eastern Anatolia and likely gave the breed its name due to their prominence in the area. Number 3. Turkish vans have a distinctive coat with van markings that make them stand out. The van pattern refers to the unique white coat with distinctive colored markings, typically on the head and tail, resembling a splash of paint. These markings can vary in size and shape, making each cat an individual masterpiece. Number 4. Some Turkish van cats have a rare chestnut color patch of fur found on the left shoulder blade. It's estimated to occur in only a small percentage of them, making it a treasured feature for cat enthusiasts. Number 5. This unique chestnut-colored patch on Turkish fans is often referred to as the Mark of Allah by cat enthusiasts and is believed to symbolize divine favor or blessing in Turkish culture. This name is associated with the belief that the distinctive pattern could represent the handprint of the Prophet Muhammad or the touch from a guardian angel. Number 6. Although cherished for its cultural significance, the unique mark does have a scientific explanation. It's likely caused by the incomplete expression of the Ogudi gene, which is responsible for tabby markings in cats. This gene can become suppressed in certain areas, leading to the appearance of darker patches like the shoulder mark. Number 7. Despite their similar names, Turkish van cats are not the same as van cats. Sure, they may have some similarities, like their looks and their origins rooted in the van region. However, Turkish vans are officially recognized by major cat associations, while van cats are not. Additionally, Turkish vans are a selectively bred breed with specific traits like consistent markings and coat type, whereas van cats are considered a natural breed. Number 8. The roots of the Turkish van are thought to be ancient, with some estimates tracing their lineage back several thousand years. Despite their presence and folklore, there is no precise historical documentation to pinpoint their exact origin date. Number 9. The Turkish van cat likely lived around Lake Van for many years, but it wasn't until the 1950s that they came to Europe. Two British photographers, Laura Lushington and Sonia Halliday, got two Turkish van cats as gifts during a trip to Turkey. They found the cats to be beautiful and playful, so they brought them back to Britain. This marked the beginning of the breed's popularity in Europe. Number 10. Initially recognized as the Turkish Cat by the Governing Council of the Cat Fancy in 1969, it was renamed Turkish Van in 1979 within the UK and 1985 in the US. This change primarily aimed to avoid confusion with the existing Turkish Angora breed. Number 11. Turkish Vans and Angoras are both Turkish beauties with distinct charms. Vans rock their iconic van-patterned coat and love water, while Angoras boast fluffy coats and regal personalities. So choose your furry friend based on your lifestyle. Vans for playful splashes and Angoras for quiet cuddles. Number 12. The Turkish Van was officially recognized as a championship breed by the International Cat Association in 1985, allowing its participation in cat shows and breeding programs. The Cat Fanciers Association also acknowledged the breed in 1994, reinforcing its standing in North America and encouraging responsible breeding practices. Number 13. Turkish vans have tufted ears that give them a touch of wild charm, enhancing their stunning appearance. These small tufts, resembling miniature lynx tips, highlight their alert expression and playful personality. This feature adds to their unique elegance and sets them apart from other cat breeds. Number 14. According to the Turkish folklore, the Turkish van cats were said to have been on Noah's Ark during the Biblical Flood. The tale goes that when the Ark came to rest on Mount Ararat, God blessed the cats by touching their heads, leaving them with a unique and distinctive color pattern. Number 15. Another variation of folktale suggests that the cats found aboard Noah's Ark were van cats distinct from Turkish van breed today. While both van cats and Turkish vans share a striking pattern, some historical accounts distinguish them based on a mark differentiating the original Ark companions from their descendants. Number 16. In 1992, a survey found that only 92 purebred Turkish van cats were left in Turkey's Lake Van region. To preserve the breed, the Turkish government officially recognized the van, implemented protective measures, and local universities started breeding programs. Today, only a few Turkish vans are sent to other countries, and most of the breeding stock in the United States comes from Europe. Number 17. Water-loving Turkish vans stand out from the feline crowd. Their water-repellent coat and strong legs turn them into aquatic superheroes, splashing in puddles, playing fetch in bathtubs, and even taking daring dips in pools and lakes. 
Number 18. In their natural habitat around Lake Van in Turkey, basking in the sun after swimming served as a vital tool for drying their semi-water-resistant fur and maintaining thermal regulation. This ancestral behavior remains ingrained in today's Turkish vans. Number 19. In 2013, the Cat Fanciers Association reported that Turkish vans ranked 41st out of 43 breeds they recognize for championship status. This means they are not as popular among cat owners in the US, possibly because there are few of them compared to other breeds. Number 20. With only around 100 kittens registered by the Cat Fanciers Association each year in the US, Turkish vans are one of the rarest cat breeds, comparable in numbers to breeds like the Peterbald or Singapore. Expect to pay between $800 and $1,500 for a kitten, with factors like pedigree, breeder reputation, unique markings and location influencing the exact price. Number 21. With mesmerizing eyes resembling polished jewels, Turkish vans exhibit stunning variations like amber, blue, or even a captivating odd-eyed combination caused by a condition known as heterochromia iridis. This kaleidoscopic gazes contribute to their enigmatic charm. Number 22. Turkish vans take longer to grow up compared to many other cat breeds. Most cats become adults at 1 to 2 years old, but these fluffy water-loving cats may take up to 4 years to fully mature. This does not make them less playful or smart, it just means they need more time to grow into their big size and charming personalities. Number 23. With their playful zest for life, striking coat, and adaptable nature, Turkish vans can grace human companions for many years. With proper care and loving environment, these fascinating felines can enjoy a lifespan of 12 to 17 years, some even exceeding that with a dash of good fortune and plenty of sunshine naps. Number 24. Turkish van kittens are not actually born with other iconic van patterns. They start out mostly white with contrasting markings as they grow. The markings become deeper and more defined, especially around the legs or face. This continues until around 3 to 5 years old when the cat reaches full maturity and its unique coat settles into its final mesmerizing pattern. Number 25. While many cats are known for their quick bursts of energy and playful agility, Turkish vans move with a distinct grace and deliberation. Their slow, deliberate walk can be quite mesmerizing, characterized by a gentle sway of their long, silky fur, and punctuated by the rhythmic steps of their powerful hind legs. Number 26. Their keen intelligence makes them adaptable to new situations and routines. With proper training and positive reinforcement, Turkish vans can learn to associate car rides and flights with positive experiences, minimizing stress and making travel more enjoyable. Number 27. While Turkish vans may have finicky tastes, a high-quality diet with ample protein and minimal carbs is key for their health and playful energy. Look for grain-free dry food or protein-rich wet options, and remember their love for water will help keep them hydrated. Number 28. Turkish vans are known for being quite active and vocal, so their communication style is certainly unique. Unlike some breeds whose mews can be piercing or insistent, Turkish vans tend to express themselves with softer, almost melodious purrs and vocalizations. Number 29. Turkish vans are gravity-defying climbers and are also known for their love of jumping on top of the highest spot in a room. Their muscular build, keen balance, and adventurous spirit let them conquer shelves, curtains, and even your heart with leaps and bounds. They turn your home into a feline park or paradise, bringing joy and agility to every room. Number 30. Unlike some breeds with dense undercoats like the Maine Coon, the Siberian Forest Cat, and the Persian, the Turkish van's fur does not tangle easily. This is because they have a soft, insulating undercoat with a longer top coat, which allows air to circulate through their fur, making matting less likely. Overall, their coats are low-maintenance in terms of matting. Number 31. Turkish vans are smart cats. They show their intelligence by being curious, enjoying puzzles and games, and figuring things out easily. They're good at exploring, learning routines, and can even open doors or turn knobs with their paws. That's why people sometimes call them the Einstein of felines. Number 32. Turkish vans are less prone to obesity, but staying active is key to their well-being. Regular exercise not only keeps them in shape, but also brings out their lively and happy nature. Whether it's climbing cat trees or chasing feathers, keeping them moving contributes to a healthy and joyful life. Alright guys, now which of these Turkish van facts surprised you the most? Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.